these photographs tell a story. You really get the feeling of what it was like to be with that gang of geniuses. Everybody had seen so many photographs of Picasso, it was rather, to me, boring. I wanted to do something totally different. I wanted to try and get inside the camera and how he manipulated and maneuvered the camera. And I wanted to make that the subject of, a, of an exhibition. And it proved to be an enormously um, interesting and, and important side to his life. Working as a biographer is, for me, very much a labor of love. I saw a lot of Picasso when I moved to the south of France, to Provence, in the 1950s. He was fascinated by photography. I think that he saw the camera more as, as, a, as a mechanism uh, that was enormously useful to him. For instance, as he was working on a sculpture, he would photograph it, and then, because he'd change the sculpture and make, make the neck shorter or longer, and he wanted to keep a record of that so he could see exactly always where he was. As photography becomes more widely recognized as an art, and as a very important art, I think it's very interesting to see how a great artist like Picasso benefited from it.